Hey planner friends, it's Mia. Welcome to Life with Mia. Today we are going to plan the week of November 18th through the 24th in the A5 Daily Duo. I am using a new kit. I don't remember. I think this is Winter Cabin. Um, could be Joyful. I think it's Winter Cabin though. Um, you see, I have my oops here where it cut through all things. So that'll be fun. This is going to be, um, available in both sizes for the, the larger box or, um, the smaller boxes. I mentioned in another video that going into the new year, I've decided that I'm only going to do the larger boxes since the format changed with the 2025 planner. Actually, if you got the mid-year um, you may already have it in the larger sizes. Um, I also think, and I've said this before, and y'all be twisting my arm. I am not going to be doing, I don't think, I, I am not going to be doing any more 7x9 daily duos. So, I don't, I just don't have the capacity to do a whole reformat for the box size on those as well when literally one maybe two people who buy them and that's like maybe three times a year it's there's no payoff for it um spending hours reformatting and then hours doing the designs for no reason because they sit there and then it costs me to list it and nobody purchases it so no more seven by nines i have to be firm on that and and draw the line sorry my seven by nine friends but um there are still some up. Um, if you would like to pick up any of those. And the pre-Black Friday sale will be a good time to get them. Because they will be 40% off. Um, let me show you some of what is coming for pre-Black Friday. This is a new kit. Um, black and white holiday. So I've got that in a large and small boxes somewhere. Um, I did a vintage monthly. Um, I think I've shown this. This is the Frost Hobonichi. This is Joyful in the Hobonichi, which is why I think this is Joyful, but I still don't remember. Um, and so that's what you're looking at. Here's the larger boxes. And that is the kit that I'm using this week. Here's the smaller boxes. Um, this is a winter floral in the monthly. Uh, winter pines. I think I put the winter floral down for December in my budget planner. But I really like this winter pines. I think I'm going to use this for January in my monthly and in my budget. Because... It is so cute. So pretty. Um, we don't get snow where I'm at. This is whimsical. Whimsical. Really hard to see the swirls in there. Um, but very pretty as well. And then there is Hobonichi in the Winter Cabin. Peppermint Mocha. Winter Pine in the A5 Daily Duo. And this is large and small boxes. Some of these things are up already. Some are not. Um, I've got to do photos and, and whatnot. Um, there is a Fall Mood collection, which is what I used last week. And then there is the... Let me set that aside. That's totally mine. Um... There is this, I forget what I call this one, but um, there's that, there's Candy Cane Lane. Um, so yeah, there's lots of A5, actually I think this is Candy Cane Lane, this might be Peppermint, Peppermint Mocha. Santa Bay is back, a lot of um, previous... A lot of the previous holiday collections are available. I did actually get all of the new budget 
items up. So if you are doing a 2025 budget planner in a seven by nine or a five wide, this is size to fit. Got her goals. 25 and 2025 project tracker um they'll do i'm i'm working on my i think i'm gonna use this for february in my budget planner um but then i have the all the annual things that i'm getting ready to do so we have a retirement and investment tracker a net worth tracker and savings debt Sinking funds, emergency fund, and then the, um, I do a business budget, but that is available, business budget and tax tracking, and the annual budget. So that is all ready to go as well, and I'm going to be starting up my 2025 budget series. These are going to be horrible to peel up. Um, like people who um, are willing to work with an oops. I'm not people. Oh, these are peeling up nicely. Okay, I spoke too soon. Um, I don't like dealing with cut through stickers. Not fun when they're cut too deep. So, the pre-Black Friday sale, I'll, I'm going to do a video with all the new releases once they are ready. I did not get nearly as far as I had hoped to get this weekend. I actually worked a little bit for work work. I'm probably going to put in a few hours tonight for work work. It's already 8 o'clock. I was like, I'm going to fix dinner. And I started like prepping to fix dinner, but then I did not <laughs> get very far. So, all the prep stuff is sitting on the counter. Um, and I like have to cook dinner because I need to have something to eat for lunch tomorrow or I will literally starve. Um, there's, there, first of all, they're not getting my dollars downtown. Everything costs entirely too much. I have to walk too far. Um, and it's like not good options because a lot of things closed. Um, but I'm not willing to spend $20 for lunch after I spent $6 for gas a gallon, um, and then paid to park. I'm not, no can't do it. So, um, and I will probably be there about 16 hours because that seems to be what I'm working these days. So I must have food to take with me. And, um, I just have 8 million things to do and not enough time to get them all done in. So I need to fix something to eat. I need to eat. Um, I need to finish laundry. Um, I need to work. <laughs> I need to work on Studio Blisco stuff. And I just like, I need to, I need to breathe. That's, that's what it comes down to. There's just not enough hours in the day right now. And it does not help that it is dark at four o'clock, three o'clock, really, um, around here. It just, the sun starts to set and it goes dark. So, that's, uh, the eight million things that I have going on at the current moment. Um, I was hoping to get a chunk. I did get a pretty good chunk, but I was hoping to get more of the items printed and laid out so that I could sort of make some decisions. I haven't even gotten through all of that. Uh, I had to go today and get ink from Staples because I ran out of ink on my one printer. Y'all remember the printer, the printer ink issue I was having. It's still an issue. I never resolved it. So, um, it prints cruddy when I use the instant ink. Instant ink knows what they do and they know they send in trash and I can't use it. So I have to go buy ink for that printer. And, um, what I usually can get away with is, um, buying black ink cartridges and using the color instant ink cartridges so it's still on an instant ink plan so I'm still limited to how much I can print on it which is dumb because I'm going and buying ink when I'm already going and paying for I'm already paying for something but I'm not receiving what I'm paying for that's a whole whole nother problem anywho 
um, I have like, I think six new doll collections. And um, that is primarily what I like to print on that printer. I don't know how many or which ones yet. Um, I want it, I want to put it in the planner slash box, but that was why I needed to go get ink because I had ran out and um, I needed to figure out what was what. Um, so I got that, I went and did that, and the good thing was I was able to pay for part of it with points because ink is expensive. I'm paying twice, so it's doubly expensive. Um, so yeah, we're doing that. Let's see, I need... Um, something on here is happening yet. No payday. Of trash day. And I did have like five fork and knives and gold. Let's do this. I'm just trying to trying to get a little bit of rest in and get all the things done. I am definitely dreading Monday because we just we left off on Friday with um violence like <laughs> and there's no doubt that we're going to pick up where we left off. So, I'm not looking forward to that at all. And it's, uh, I'm trying to work on myself and just like woosaw and not be irritated. But I'm so irritated, y'all. So irritated. I feel like I'm not asking much. Asking for people to just do their job. But that seems to be really hard. And so that leaves me extremely frustrated because it negatively impacts me and my team. And here's the thing. I could totally do it myself. But my boss, who also supervises the person who did not do their job, wants them to do it. And I am a person who already struggles with delegating because... My experience has been delegating something to someone and them not doing it or not doing it right. And then me having to do it anyway, but in a method of scrambling to get it done. I don't like that. So here we are once again in that situation. And um, I don't... Um, I don't know. I, I can, I just, because I said something, it's going to be a problem. So, I don't think I'm going to be able to, what do they call that? Uh, bite your tongue? I'm not going to be able to do that. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Nope. The, uh... Let me find some dolls because I'm not finding the stickers I'm looking for. The irritation has been unleashed and she is not willing to hold back. So, y'all gonna get some updates and it's gonna be a wild and crazy ride. Hold on. This week is it's gonna be interesting. And listen, if this problem indoors, I'm supposed to be off for Thanksgiving. So... What do I have? I have 
see. Thing here. And then I'll have a thing here. I gotta call it Phoenix. Um, and then I need to like, and then here's the other thing. Like, I'm not supposed to even be there. And so like, I schedule stuff around not being there. I don't like boxes and things, packages sitting out here. So I make sure that I do it in a manner that I'm going to be here. I, you know, <laughs> I need to go get PD's medicine. I can't go do that because by the time I get there and it's too late, it, after I've been sat in traffic for 10 years, it like anxiety on 5,000. It's just a whole, it's just created a whole, what do you call that? Where it just steamrolls, you know, the, the ball gets rolling and you can't stop it. That is where we're at. And so I don't think people like realize that that is the level of frustration that I'm at because of all of the negative impacts that have been created by one person failing to do their part. And because I have trust issues, I followed up multiple times and was assured that it was done when it wasn't. So we didn't have to be in this place. So now it's like, I just don't like you. <laughs> so that's where we've evolved. I just don't like you because... You've, you've gone beyond inconveniencing me. You've made my life unnecessarily difficult. I might use that. Okay, so let's see. I gotta put this down because this is a reminder that I definitely need to play the little envy game for my savings. Right now, I'm actually hungry, which is surprising. Okay. I think I'll put down a grocery list here. Let's see if I have... The other thing I need to do is like break down my garden because we didn't skip to fall. Mm, I'm not sure. I feel like we went straight to winter. It's cold. Um, Petey doesn't even want to go outside. He's like, mm, no thanks. We don't put this give thanks sticker over here so we can remember to be thankful. Because right now we're not feeling it.
Okay, I need this quote. It says a negative mind will never give you a positive result. So we're going to try to have a positive mind as we embark into crazy. But we also are not trading our authenticity for approval. Because that's how we get steamrolled. And uh, we're out here playing the Hunger Games, y'all. The Hunger Games. Survival of the fittest. If you're wondering about these quotes, I'm working on a custom order. So you may see these coming to the shop. I'm not sure if this is the final product just yet. It's a little bit of a prototype. Exactly the right color, but actually, no, that does not. That does not work. But okay, I'm going to use it anyway. I was looking for like a burgundy, but or a dark green. I got like lime green. So I'm going to put Not matching colors, just all sort of continue as a theme. So I am hoping that I can. on Tuesday. I 
this works nicely. I don't know if this goes with the kit, but it matches. So we are going to put this down because I have to um, have like a way that I can see. We get a glance, all the things that I need to do in preparation for the sale this week. Wish this was at the beginning of my week. Wish that was part of the the revision, but nobody listens to me. My request for changes, so we get what we get, and that's what we got. All right, I need one more to do sticker. And I think that is going to do it. So, we've got Monday, five PM, Tuesday, we're going to try to go pick up medicine, Wednesday, Thursday, got a medical, got an eye doctor appointment. I'm going to try to pick up journaling cards. And then Friday, Saturday, Sunday. All right, so that's going to do it for this week in the A5 Daily Duo. Hope you enjoyed this video and got some ideas for planning in your own planner. Be sure to check out the Black Friday sale, which is starting early. It is starting a week before Black Friday on the... 22nd um and i probably will have a video up on thursday lord willing if i get it all together and um i'm not working at this job until midnight every night um so i will do my best to get that up and show all of the new releases hope that y'all have a wonderful week if you could just say a little prayer for me to have a non-combative non-microaggression non not people doing their job week i greatly appreciate it all right thanks so much for watching hit that like button i'll see you back here next time bye